Hello. My name is Isabel. I'm doing a review on Boxum's Red Hot set. Um, I ordered it off Sephora because it was an online exclusive. It came in this bag. I don't know if you can see it. So inside we have all these products. You have the lip gloss, you have the eyeliner, you have the red lipstick in Barcelona, and you have the mascara. Now, the reason I really wanted to do this video was because I was looking for the perfect red lipstick. Now, I love, love, love Bare Minerals and this is also one of Bare Minerals brands. And this is a matte lipstick in Barcelona. Let's see if it can focus on there. Um, it has a sharpener on the bottom. And it's almost as a lip crayon. It's not too fat, but it's not too thin. The tip, you can just sharpen to always keep that edge. So I really wanted to show you this color. I do have experience with using Boxum's crayons. They're a matte finish. Um, however, they do have that perfect amount of moisture that you're looking for so it's not so dry. Um, also, it doesn't bleed, which is a big, big thing for me. That's a big deal. Um, no one wants lipstick that bleeds, especially if it's red. So I'm going to go ahead and apply it so I can show you. And there you go. If you can see, it is a matte finish, but it's not super shiny. So it has right in the center, and it's that nice, bright, but also perfect Marilyn Monroe red is what I like to call it. Next in the box is a clear gloss. Now, you can choose to wear this with or without the Barcelona lipstick that I have on. Um, it's absolutely clear, as you can see. Um, pretty much, I'm going to try it on so that you can see how glossy this is going to get. It is going to stain the brush, so Please be aware that your gloss is also going to stop being clear. It's going to turn a little pinkish. And there you have it. Let me see if I can um, reduce the light here so that you're better able to see the color. Oh, 
Okay. Something else that I want to do a review on that's also in the box is the mascara. As far as the lip products that are in the box, I'm very happy with. However, super disappointed when it came to the mascara. It is an oval tube and it has a zigzaggy wand. Now, not only was the product difficult to put on with this wand, um, the hairs that it's like a plasticky little spikes that it has on the wand it made it very difficult to apply the mascara so I was applying mascara literally for like 10 minutes um, apart from the fact that it's difficult to put in and out the wand struggles to get in and out of the tube not to mention that the mascara was not as creamy as I expected. It's actually pretty dry. So I was not happy at all with this mascara. Now, moving on to the eyeliner. The eyeliner is a uh, liquid, it's not pencil. It's in the form of a pen. Now, the pen is flat, as you can see. If you want thinner lines, you use the tip and you apply it this way. If you want thicker lines, you would use the flat surface get that and you would apply it this way I used it you should be very careful it does not dry that quickly so you should allow at least 30 seconds 40 seconds for it to dry before you open your eyes and start working so that's pretty much my review for today thank you very much